What's going on YouTube? Jelani from JelaniTheMarketer.com here, back again with another video. And in this video, guys, I'm going to be talking about the day two of Trey Llewellyn's 30-day challenge. Now, if you haven't watched my previous video, um, I'm doing a challenge that Trey Llewellyn has designed. Um, it's called Reactive Funnels, and it's part of the 30-day challenge that Russell Bruns Brunson is running. Um, so if you haven't watched that video, go check that out by clicking the link below. But this is the second day to that um, series where I'm doing a follow along so you guys can follow uh, along and watch me actually try to make money out of thin air basically. But before I go into today's video topic, um, hit that subscribe button if you haven't subscribed yet and hit that alert button as well so you know when I post a new video. So what we're gonna be talking about here is automations. Now in video one, day one, I actually called the magazine company so that I can get the back issues for the last 12 months um, for each magazine now they haven't got back to me yet and I think it's because they're at a conference I actually called them again today no answer and then I did some research on the person that is supposed to be answering um, I found her LinkedIn and I found her Twitter and I found out that she is at a conference right now so hopefully that conference ends either today or tomorrow and I'll give her a call again maybe on Thursday if, she, if I don't hear back from her tomorrow so um, that's what's going on there so while that is happening while I'm waiting to um, you know get a confirmation back from that the magazine company uh, what I like to do is build out some systems right so on day three or day four I forget where um, Trey says to start setting this up but basically you need to set up a automation inside of um, an email marketing cam uh, service so am I my uh, email service is active campaign so if you haven't signed up for active campaign sign up by clicking the link below because honestly in my opinion it's the best email marketing solution for any type of business so definitely click that link so you can get the free trial and start um, checking it out right and follow along with me so um, I'm gonna be setting that up and I'm gonna show you guys how to, how I do it inside of ClickFunnels so uh, what you need to do is get your account and then inside of ClickFunnels you know integrate it and then once you have a funnel I'm gonna show you my funnel but not yet not in this video yet I'm still tweaking it and still kind of you know designing it so once it's done I'll show you guys that funnel and what it looks like but basically what you want to do um, it's basically just integrate that with your account and then once you have that integration on the funnel step itself then you will start setting it up so in my case what I like to do is add people to specific lists so in active campaign you create a list so you just come here create a list in my case the list is called gaming junkies entry so when someone subscribes and opts in on click funnels to this specific list they are going to um, be uh, given a tag and that tag is G uh, J entry one okay so what we do, and I can just show you really quickly without deleting this, is basically add a plus sign, um, and then go to contacts, subscribes, and then you select a list here. So you can say demo list, for example, and then you go uh, add another um, automation, and then you add a tag, right? So then you can just say testing tag here, and then save, and then you know that's how it would look. That's how it looks up here, right? Um, so it's very simple, right? So when someone subscribes to a list, they're given a tag. Very very simple. So once you have that, you want to click on active, uh, activate, or active, um, and then you want to go to automations again, and then you're going to go to new automation, and start from scratch. So this is the same process for this. So uh, the G, uh, GJ contest is always a new automation, start from scratch, and then you do a second one, start from scratch, and then it will be the actual follow-up sequence where we're going to start sending them email so this all starts based on when that tag is applied so when someone is subscribed to that list added a tag that tag is then what starts this automation so once they get that tag added they are going to wait for five minutes so you just add a plus sign conditions and workflows wait for a specific uh, period of time and then you say you know minutes or whatever right wait five minutes then send email one so in this email what we're going to be um, saying is like hey welcome to gaming junkies you know giving them introductions so if I show you this real quick you can see um, the full email but basically it's just introducing who you are um, and then it, I'm asking you three questions at the end so um, this is something that Trey recommended so at the end you're just trying to get some information from them so that they respond to your email so that um, it doesn't go to spam right so like all these emails that are being sent out do not go to spam which is Really important you want that email to hit directly to their inbox okay so these are just the, the simple questions here you can obviously you know copy this and change that out the niche um, so let's actually continue on the automation process so we wait for one day again just adding a plus sign wait for one day and then this is an if else statement so you just click on plus instead of sending email we go to conditions and workflows if else 
And then you set up the statement. So does this contact match the following conditions? Has opened a campaign email um, and has replied. So what I ask in here is that they reply to this email. So in this email, um, let's actually go there really quickly so I can show you that. So if you go to edit, um, I say, you know, reply to this email with those three questions. Then we go to next here. And then what we activate here is reply tracking. Okay, so uh, active campaign knows if they replied or not. That's really important. So if they reply, then what we're going to do is we're going to send them the second email. But if they don't reply, what we're going to do, so you can see here, wait until, this, until they open and reply. So if they do open it and they do reply, then we're going to send the second email, which is a survey email. So in this email, we're actually linking them to a survey. And I'll show you that survey in a second. Uh, but so if they don't reply what we're going to do is we're going to send them the same email the first email the same email but with a different subject headline um, just so that we can increase that open rate and response rate from that person okay so this is literally the same email just a different subject headline um, and then what we do here is we wait for a day and then we just go to another action so you can add the plus sign go to another action which is send the email to right so we wait one day go to another action send that email um, so everyone's getting all the same emails basically it's just we want to try to increase that open rate right so once you have done that um, what we do is uh, you send a survey email so let's actually I'll show you that now so you can see hey thanks first name thanks for getting back to me blah 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 and then at the end I want them to click this link um, let's actually hyperlink this so let's copy that and then hit this little link here and then paste so it's hyperlinked and it'll turn white for some reason, but you just got to make this red. All right, boom. So we can save and exit. So let me show you the survey now, actually. Um, so basically, I'm just saying, can you answer these, these questions? Let us know how you feel below. Don't be shy. Um, and these are questions that Trey actually um, says in his, uh, his 30 day challenge plan. Um, that you should ask. So what have you recently Googled regarding gaming, right? Um, how important was it to find the answer to that question, low, medium, high, right? So I want them to be like five on the high end, one on the low end. Um, do you find, did you find the answer you were looking for? Yes, no. And then if you could wave, um, I actually need to edit this to get rid of that, but that's, that's on the final edit. That's okay. Um, if you could wave a magic wand to uh, make the most painful problem disappear, what would that be? I want them to respond here and then what's your favorite saying phrase quote regarding gaming right and this is just to get more information about the the the, the customer or the, the contact right like we want to know what is their triggers what's their highs what their what's their lows what's their yeses what what's their no's um so that we can uh better prepare our offers and email marketing and and you know mess um facebook messaging right automation we want to make sure that we're tailoring our offers to our our customers or our clients right so that's the survey email and then I'm still building out the um, rest of the emails but the next four emails are going to be all affiliate offers so I'll just do you know send an email then wait one day send an email wait one day send an email wait one day send an email um, so that's the automation sequence for the email marketing like I said I'm still been building out the affiliate offers but I'm trying to actually I'm trying to find affiliate offers that will match this um, niche but that's basically how it's set up and that's what I'm doing in terms of um, email marketing. Now there, there are some other things that we will go over in, in the, the future days, but it, it regards um, more about like them replying uh, because the point of this again is to get their reactions and get their what, what really triggers them so that we can again tailor our offers to them but also we're trying to make a relationship with this person or whoever is responding back to them we want them to feel like we are taking care of them that we are understanding them that we are basically their friend right even though we're not really like their friend per se but we are someone that they can relate to because we're we're in the same niche we're in the same um demographic in terms of what we like okay so that is what the email marketing situation is looking like as of right now like i said guys i'm going to be giving you updates as it happens this is the second day of the challenge so like i said i'm still waiting for the magazines to call me back but while we're waiting we're still working right we're still doing things we're setting up these email uh, marketing um sequences we're setting up our bot sequences which will be i'll probably show you that tomorrow 
um, in another update so I can show you what I'm doing in terms of that. I might give you a little preview of the funnel as well. But stay tuned for more videos because this challenge is going to be awesome. I feel it. I feel really good about it. I feel like we're putting in the work. We're putting in effort. And that's all that matters is you put in constant action, right? Um, I didn't get a call back yet. That's fine. I have other things I can do to prepare myself in terms of getting that call, right? Like so once they call back and say, hey, you know, we will give you those 12 months back issues so that you can start so that I can start looking for products and brands that will potentially donate to us so that we can keep this ball rolling, right? So thank you guys so much for watching. I know this is like a quick little update, but this is going to be awesome. I hope you learned like how to do some email mar marketing inside of Active Campaign. Like I said, if you haven't signed up for Active Campaign, click that link below so that you can follow along and start um, trying this out for yourself as well. It's really cool, and I think it's the most advanced and the best email marketing um, program out there. I'm not just saying that, but I really do believe that. So definitely click that link below. So if you guys like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you have any comments or suggestions, please leave those down below. And if you haven't subscribed yet, subscribe and click that alert button so you know when I release a new video because this is going to be a daily thing where I'm giving you guys updates and I'm following the challenge um, what, you know, what, what Trey is saying. So uh, definitely subscribe and hit that alert button. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.